If you can imagine a deer the size of a house cat, then you've thought of a poodoo. There are currently two classified poodoo species, northern poodoos and southern poodoos. Southern poodoos average 16 inches in height at the shoulder and 25 pounds in weight, while northern poodoos average 13 inches in height and 10 pounds in weight, making them the smallest true deer species alive today. Technically, mouse deer are the smallest living hooved animals. However, though they have deer in their common name, they're not classified in the deer family. Poodoos live in South America. Southern poodoos live in forests with dense overgrowth in which they can hide. They'll create tunnels through the undergrowth that run throughout their territory. In general, they're found below 6,500 foot elevations, which is sort of the opposite of their northern neighbors. Northern poodoos live between 6,500 and 13,000 feet above sea level in mountainous forests and grasslands above the tree line. Both species enjoy fresh, green vegetation that grows along the edge of forests. Their small stature can make obtaining these leaves, ferns, grasses, and shrubs somewhat difficult. So poodoos will actually rear up on their back legs to make themselves taller. And they'll also climb on top of fallen logs to assist them in obtaining food. They also eat fallen fruit from the forest floor. Their tiny size provides them the ability to easily hide from predators. However, when they are spotted, they'll be eaten by pumas, foxes, owls, and even domestic dogs. Poodoos will happily run and prance on a cool day. It's thought that they don't tolerate heat very well because they're often found seeking out shade. They've also been described as being more active on windy days. Southern poodoos tend to be uniform in their coloration, while the northern poodoo's head is often dark brown to nearly black. Male poodoos grow antlers, which may be up to four inches long. These are shed each year, and regrowth begins around July. In general, males and females are usually ready to mate by about one year of age. The breeding season is from April to June, and fawns are born from November to January. The babies take about 210 days to develop, and one or two will be born at a time. They'll stay with their mom until they're ready to have babies of their own about a year later. They'll have to move to a new territory since poodoos are solitary, only really coming together for the breeding season and sometimes while eating. On average, they live to be about 10 years old in the wild. Thank you to our patrons, Spike Spiegel 93 Dad, and everyone else for their support of this channel. For more facts on poodoos, check out the links in the description. Give a thumbs up if you learned something new today, and thank you for watching Animal Fact Files.